Hello, people on the internet, and welcome back to Let's Play Assassin's Creed 4 Black Flag. Um, I think the Electoral College vote has just been through like a few minutes ago, and uh, Joe Biden, yeah, uh, roughly 15 minutes ago. Um, Biden has won the Electoral College vote and is now officially 46th President of the United States, I think. Not really sure about it, but you know, he won the Electoral College vote, not just the popular vote where he got the Electoral College one, but the college, Electoral College vote was just, you know, they just did it and the Electoral Colleges, they, they voted for Biden. I don't know, it's US voting system. I can't even really understand the, the German one, even though I had it in school. We focus more on the European one, which is hilariously stupid. Um, not the European one, the EU one. It's hilarious, hilariously stupid. Um, go just, there are a lot of, of uh, information sites out there for the EU voting system. Just take a look at it. It's ridiculous. It's probably even worse than the the American system because you don't really vote the people that make the decisions you only vote the people that can debate on stuff and the final decision is with people you, you don't elect them but the governments of the EU elect them and they all have a veto right I think it's, what the <sighs> it's complicated it's stupid just take a look at it you're going to freak. And now, let's finally continue with the observatory. Yeah. Um, yeah. All right, we are here. We have to find a way out. Good, we don't have to see the, the thing magic again. Very, very well. Um, yes, so to continue what I want to say, um, as you might, might have, I don't know, did I tell that in the last part? When did I record the last part? Let me, let me check that quickly. Um, da, 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 Ubisoft games, Assassin's Creed 4, Black Flag. The observa have I uploaded the observatory already? Oh, I haven't. Wait. <laughs> now I'm confused. Oh, I haven't uploaded the last video even. Oopsie, I thought I had to record it today. Um, did I have? No, piece five didn't even arrive when I recorded the video. Uh, it's been two weeks since I recorded the last one. Oopsie. And yeah, there were no videos on the channel. Um, I pre-recorded the last video, but I didn't upload it for private reasons. That's all. Um, then I want to start uploading again. And I uploaded the last, uh, the, 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 the part 66. But uh, during that upload, uh, it took me uh, around 15 hours to upload because my internet connection was staggeringly low. And with staggeringly low, I mean so ridiculously low that it might not even have been that. I think I had like two M bits of upload speed instead of 50. Around that. So you know I had like 4% um, in upload. And I had like 3% in download. So you know. That was funny. And uh, yeah, 
Uh, I'll talk about the PS5 in a moment. Oh yeah, and by the way, we, we are supposed to be to be out right now. It's part of the story. You ah. want to survive. We're bleeding out, but you know, uh, there will be a sequence right now, and I'm gonna mute myself, so have fun with that. That's the beauty of a democracy. The many outvote the one. Oh, you could sail with me, but with a temper as hot as yours, I fear you'd burn us all to cinders. Luckily, I know the king's bounty on your head is a large one, and I intend to collect. Have you, uh, have you ever seen the inside of a Jamaican at some point? Congrats, we're going to Jamaican prison. I think we have a real life thing going on before we go back into it. Uh, if not, I will mute myself. Uh, no, no, real life part, okay. Nevertheless, there's some story here, so I'll mute myself too. If they start to talk right now, they don't. Okay. Hello? How are you? If you're anxious, that'll pass. It's the medazolam. I'm sorry about this. But we've had so many security breaches, we were forced to take drastic action. And Olivier is missing. He left for Chicago two days ago, but... No one's seen him since. I know this seems excessive, but with our high-level security clearance, we have an obligation to our shareholders. Rest assured, we will compensate you when hackers found. So get some rest, okay? And if you're up to it, maybe capture some more footage? You're doing amazing work. I can't wait to show you the work we've been doing with your stuff. Take care. Yeah. <laughs> so, they tossed you in the bunker. Nice. Those Templars upstairs aren't taking any chances. I think we need to erase all the dirt they might have on you. Did you hear that? Sounds <laughs> I good. I think I just gave you level 3 security clearance. Now, head to the security room and use the cameras to watch the door to the server farm. Unfortunately, Melanie's in there now. So when I escort her out, that's when you make your move. I'd wipe these servers myself, but as the head of IT, I'd be a suspect. It has to be someone they've already locked up. Ah, oh, these Templars. They run our lives, you know. Ah, uh, they decide elections, they control various capital markets, and they inject us with little microchips to track our movements and read our thoughts. It's all very scary. You know, that's that's why we have so many um, people out there thinking that there's a big... Oh god, I don't know the English word for this. Ugh. Again. Ugh. Exhausting. Um. Ooh, sticky note. Only 15 left of these. We can only collect uh, the, the, the leftover ones and the, we can only hack the leftover computers once we're through with the, the game's story. Um, yeah. So. That, that's it. Um. I think we'll we'll do a, a part where we just talk about stuff. 
Ooh, Robert de Sable. Or Robert de Sable. Robert de Sable. Uh, quite important, I think. He plays a... Not a... He has an important role in the story in Assassin's Creed Unity, I think. Well, at least one de Sable has a, a role in there. Someone called de Sable. I think it was Robert de Sable. Oh, there's the elevator. No, there are the server rooms. This is the security part. All right, listen. I'm entering the server Sticking room Sticking out. When you see us leave, get in there. Now, take the camera. Oh, right. Uh, that's an easy one. Do, 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 do. Um. Huh? Oh, right, no. It's it's eleven times uh thirty-five. Ah. No, wait, it's not. It's... I'll, I'll explain later. There's no need for you to be down here by yourself, Miss LeMay. My team will handle the investigation. But you need an extra set of eyes on this thing, John. We don't even know when the hacker's broken. It could take weeks to go through this data. One, at most. Still too long. I can't keep my team locked up for a week. Legally, you can. It's what they signed up for, even if they didn't read their contracts. Yes, of course. I just hate the idea. So what's the next step? My team is processing the data now. We'll start sifting through it tonight. Scouts on or coffee's on me, okay? It was obviously 21 times, not 11 times. Mm. I made a um, mistake there. Alright. I ditched her at the coffee stand. Find the server containing the network logs. Since I have a record of each and every one of your hacks, we'll just search for the timestamps on those and turn that data into something harmless. Easy as that. Yeah, yeah, it will be as easy as that. Surely. <laughs> Here we are. Beautiful. I'll update your communicator one more time. A little program I cooked up just for this purpose. There we go. I think that worked. Try it out. I know what will happen right now, but you don't. And um, I warn you, if you have no idea about what's happened in Assassin's Creed 3, um, don't... Don't. Don't watch, don't watch uh, this next part. Get an update on Assassin's Creed 3, then come back here. It's important. Okay, not happening right now. We still have to steal the data. <laughs> now I have to pause and get an update on everything that has happened story wise in Assassin's Creed Three. Not yet. <laughs> There's still this video. The dawn of the deadly 18th century. Rogues and sailors band together to live their lives by the sword. With no laws or morals, no gods, 
and no fear. Only betrayal, mutiny, cruelty, and debauchery. There is plunder to be found on golden beaches. Will you risk life and soul to fight the pirates of nightmares? Benjamin Hornigold, Calico Jack, Charles Bane, and Blackbeard? I can feel you, Cypher. Feel, but hardly touch. Signal is still too weak, and I am spread thin. Unfocused, like static in fog. Lingering in networks and nodes, the nervous system of the world. And here? Perhaps the temple was open too soon. But this was not by choice. The cataclysm pushed all doubt aside. <sighs> we bless poor Desmond, who gave his life so that you, the children of our labors, would live on to fulfill your purpose and ours, in mine. But now is not the time. My strength is not sufficient to inhabit an organic vessel. There is more work to do, more samples to acquire, more artifacts to find before my will can obtain. What's happening? Tell me! Make me whole again, my children, my instruments. Bring me forth to fulfill your purpose. Tell me! No, no, no! Something's wrong! God damn it! She should be here! Now! Living in that goddamned head of yours! Fuck, 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 fuck! Why did she spare you? Why are you still here? And like the good working class person we are. We just returned to our workstation after witnessing that. <laughs> it's, it's, you know, because we can't talk, we don't have a voice. That might not have been the, the best decision they've ever made um, concerning this, to don't give the new main character, the Abstergo employee, a voice. That could have cleared up all this... Um, you know, little real life story problems. Nevertheless, I don't think we'll talk about much stuff uh, today. Let's head back to the Animus. Majesty's Court contends that the defendants, Mary Reed and Anne Bonney, did piratically, feloniously, and in an hostile manner attack, engage, and take seven certain fishing boats. Secondly, this court contends that the defendants lurked upon the high seas and did set upon, shoot at, and take to certain merchant sloops, thus putting the captains and their crews in corporeal fear of their lives. Edward James Kenway born of motley parentage in Swansea, to an English father and Welsh mother, married at 18 to Miss Caroline Scott, now estranged. She's a beautiful woman, I am told, but not at all well these days. If you touch her, you bastard, thou. Quite a surprise finding you here rotting in a Jamaican prison. We heard rumors that you had taken up with the pirate Roberts. If you know the observatory's location, tell us now, and you'll be out of here in a flash. Rogers can hold these British hounds at bay, for a time. But this will be your fate if you fail to cooperate. You, Mary Reed and Anne Bonny, 
are to go from hence to the place from whence you came, and from thence to the place of execution, where you shall be severally hanged by the neck, till you are severally dead, dead, dead! Oh, Ross! May God in his infinite mercy be merciful to each of your souls! Was pregnant! Do you all hear that? What the devil did she say? They plead their bellies, my lord. Aye, you can't hang a woman quick with child, can ye? Quiet! Quiet! If what you claim is true, then your executions will be stayed, but only until your terms are up. Then I'll be up the duff the next time you come knocking. Remove them! You gotta love Anne, don't you? What's your name? Pillock? Ken Moore? Conway? It's Walpole, ain't it? Walpole? Where'd you get that? Well, that's the rumor going round. As dirty and daft a pirate as ever sailed these West Indies. Well, whatever his name, you ought to make sure he suffers without dying. Orders from the governor. And back to the prisons at sundown. And massage his feet if he's aching. I'm not an expert, but it's night. I mean, are they going to let them out there for, I don't know, almost 24 hours? I'm not an expert, that, but that does not seem to be, you know torture him without killing him because 24 hours in that cage certainly will kill him because well there's the, the the lack of anything and you know the sun the jamaican sun that would for certainly kill him in that time because well they don't have the survivor techniques we have today and other stuff but that's like really playing loose with the not killing him thing. Jesus. A hey! Shit detail. Quiet! Open the gibbet. Ah! Oi! You stop that! You've seen the dead guard there too, haven't you? Ah! You. Oi! Quiet! Now you have the whistle, and now you see him. Good morning, Captain Kenway. I have a gift for you. Do not mistake my purpose here. I have come for Anne and Mary, and you owe me nothing for this. Ah. But if you would lend me your aid, I can promise you safe passage from this place. I'll need weapons. You are comfortable with this, I am told. We must hurry. Now, this is pot racing. <laughs> Sorry, I, I couldn't resist. Okay, now, side missions. Sabotage alarm bells, visit old right, visit old friends. <gasps> Yes, the one I forget to do quite regularly. One of the old friends is um, inside one of these cages on the beach side, so we'll have to search for that. Alright, and we probably shouldn't be seen. Oi, he's off! Coward! Get back here! Shut up. Have these three kill each other? No, make a good.
goodbye to him. <gasps> Have these two taken out. There is one of the old friends. Uh, right, um, I'll find a way through this before that. Oh boy. Oh, now you are looking away. Now you're going away. No one's looking here. You weren't much of a friend, Jack Rackham, nor an able sailor, neither. But you were strange and lively. You there? And you oh, made me oh, laugh more on. than once. And that's enough to make me sorry for seeing you like this. I hope you found a lasting peace down there among the dead. Yes. And we have to sabotage alarm bells. Well, there's one right there. Oh, there! Stop! Yes, yes, yes. Please come here. Please come here. Come back, you weakly coward! Get back here! You there! Stop! This is quite a long mission, and uh, I think we'll have to to make a break in the game after, you know, sabotaging uh, this next uh, alarm bell. Yes, come here, come here. Be a good guard. Follow the whistle. Bye bye. Was a whistle. Give over. I didn't see him. <whistles> now come here, investigate it. Oh, fine. Alarm! Shit! Alarm! Alarm! Ah. He's over there. Dang it. Come on, don't lose that shit. Stop the bastard. Help! <sighs> Fine. Ugh. We'll do it the old fashioned way. Faster, lads. We're losing ground. In the beginning, I wanted to do this secretly. Oh, we didn't have time for this stuff. Let them call the alarm bell. Buster! He's getting away! We'll just kill them all. <laughs> oh yeah, by the way. That is something they should have fixed again in this mission. You know, the little details. Like him cutting down alarm bells without a sword. Ooh, someone wants to shoot at me. Well, then we'd better make sure he does never think of that idea ever again. Now, shouldn't we? This one start to shoot at people. Hmm. Oh right, there's Atavai. We can see him still near. Hold on. Get that bye bye. Uh yeah. And uh 
with that short expedition, we still have to find the third alarm bell. Oh no, you don't come back. Yes, 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 you do. Go there, then we'll off you all one by one. Stop him, Dave! Attack his flank! Or not? Bloody hell. Don't get my nose. What the heck's the third alarm bell? There it is. Why are you there? Stop getting on my nose. Don't have time for this shit. Uh, yeah, with that, I'd say that's it for the video. Hope you liked it. Leave a comment, rate the video. We'll see each other in the next video where we'll go through this exact mission um, to the end. And yeah, may the force be with you. And bye.